Lawrence Perlin Getty. This is Christ Climbed Down. Christ climbed down from his bare tree this year and ran away where there were no roofless Christmas trees hung with candy canes and breakable stars. Christ climbed down from his bare tree this year and ran away to where there will no gilded Christmas trees and no tinsel Christmas trees and no tinfoil Christmas trees and no pink plastic Christmas trees and no gold Christmas trees and no black Christmas trees and no powder blue Christmas trees hung with electric candles and encircled by tin electric trains and clever cornball relatives. Christ climbed down from his bare tree this year and ran away to where no intrepid Bible salesman covered the territory in two-tone Cadillacs and where no Sears robot creches complete with plastic babe and manger arrived by a parcel post, the babe by special delivery, and where no televised wise men praised the Lord Calvert Whiskey. Christ climbed down from his bare tree this year and ran away to where no fat hat shaking stranger in a red flannel suit and a fake white beard went around passing himself off as some sort of North Pole elf crossing the desert to Bethlehem, Pennsylvania in a Volkswagen sled drawn by rollicking Adirondack reindeer with German names and bearing sacks of humble gifts, sacks Fifth Avenue, oh. for everybody's imagined Christ child. Christ climbed down from his bare tree this year and ran away to where no Bing Crosby carolers groaned of a tight Christmas, where no Radio City Angels ice skated wingless through a winter wonderland into a jingle bell heaven daily at 8.30 with midnight mass animals. Christ climbed down from his bare tree this year and softly stole away into some anonymous Mary's womb again, where in the darkest night of everybody's anonymous soul, he awaits again an unimaginable and impossibly immaculate reconception the very craziest of second counts. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.